Those were the times. The times when nobody was playing our record anywhere in the world. To Hang It Tough was the number one album. It was so crazy. We put out this album and the records were so in demand and you guys were so crazy and everything was so amazing that the record company said, hey, let's put out another album. And it was winter time and we came up with this one. It's, it's a record a lot of you think I don't like. But I actually like the record, I just didn't like the album cover. We actually did a photo shoot where we, uh, I think some of you guys spray painted Merry Merry Christmas and we did a whole photo shoot in front of that on a brick wall. Mm -hmm. And the record company thought it was too street. Even though we had just did Hanging Tough and we were in a train station on that album cover. And so we walk into this second photo shoot and there's a sled and fake snow and Santa hats and ugly sweaters, yes. And we said we're not getting on that sled. And the president of Columbia Records came down to the photo shoot, we were in New York City, came down and said, Listen, you little motherfuckers. Get the fuck on that sled or you're never gonna sell another record again. His name is Donnie Einer. It's a true story and we all just walked and got on the sled. <laughs> We, you know what? There was rumors that Donnie was connected to a certain organization. <laughs> so we didn't want, no, not that Donnie, the Donnie. Donnie, Donnie. Donnie. We didn't yeah. want no trouble. So you understand. You um, understand. I, I just noticed, um, is it two people in this photo have shorts on? Yep. <laughs> I just noticed that. Yep. It's hard to tell so whose leg is who. Oh, I know whose fucking legs they are, I know. <laughs> Because I'm one of the assholes with shorts on. Oh, okay, so it's Donnie and Joe. It's yeah. Joey. <laughs> Get this. Little Joey Christmas. <laughs> Let's put Joey in some shorts. Yeah. And a little Christmas fella. And we were so unhappy with that photo that we weren't smiling. And I was because I was super happy in 16. <laughs> Going on eight years old, so I didn't know what's wrong. What's wrong with the sled? But everybody else, they had to, they had to uh, Photoshop other pictures in happier setups. That was, that's, that's it. Yeah, those happy faces, specifically mine, is why I immediately uh, stopped smiling for the rest of my new kids' experience. Yeah. And every photo shoot became this. <laughs> and the photographer would say, can't you smile, Donnie? And I'd go... <laughs> and then look at look the results. Say, would, you put, would you put your hat up and you'd go... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, it happens, you know, when you, you get kind of... We love the album, don't get me wrong. I play this uh, in my house on Christmas time. And, and like, um, Letter to Santa Claus, I still cry every time I hear that song. It's a great album. Um, it's just that photo really, it scars us. It scars us. One of these dress up nights on the cruise in the future, if you guys, someone dresses like that, you'll win every fucking prize. Every and you might get thrown off the boat, but that's okay. Anyway, it's not Christmas time, and we're not gonna sing any of that because Danny won't let us. But that, that happy-go-lucky CD. No, hold on, guys. Hold on. Did you ever really start to cry over something you just wrote? Well, I'm writing you, dear Santa. It'll be the saddest little note. 
Jordan? There's a fake for me Christmas time That I should be alone You know how much I'm missing her Would you kindly bring her home? It's gonna tear him up. I'm sure if all this reindeer would wear his room on his leg, then I'd receive a big bright package and she'll be mine today. 